Today I am going to show you how to log into ClassLink from home. I will include a few tips, tricks, and troubleshooting hints. First, we're going to use Chrome. We recommend using Chrome as we seem to have fewer issues with it. We need to check first to see if Chrome is updated. To do this, I'm going to click on the three dots on the upper right-hand corner. Then I will click on Settings. Once in the Settings, I'll find the button that says About Chrome in the bottom left-hand corner of my screen. When I click on this, the computer automatically will check for updates and it will bring the latest update to my browser if one is needed. The next thing I'm going to do is clear my cache. To do this in Chrome, I hold down Control, Shift, and Delete at the same time. A menu will come up that will ask me to clear my cache. Make sure that you select All Time for the time range, and make sure that Cached Images and Files is selected. You do not need Browsing History or Cookies selected just cached image files. When you're done with this, click on Clear Data. Now my browser is ready to go to ClassLink. To get to ClassLink, I'm going to go to OsceolaSchools.net. On the top right-hand corner, there's a button for ClassLink. If I was at school, I would just click here to sign on and it would bring me right into ClassLink. Since I'm at home, I'm going to have to do a little bit more. I need to enter my user ID number and my password. Then I'll click on sign in. Now I'm in ClassLink. Take a look at the top right-hand corner of the browser. You'll notice a little icon for the Class Link extension. Having this extension allows Class Link to sign you in with a simple one click. To see if Class Link is installed, I'm going to click on my Office 365 student icon. Here it is not installed and I am prompted to install it. So I'm going to click on the Install Extension button. Next you will click on Add to Chrome and then click on Add Extension. If you were not automatically prompted to install ClassLink, you can always Google it. Go to ClassLink Extension and click on Class Link Downloads. You'll see the option here to download Class Link for Chrome or other browsers you may choose to use. Since many students have recently changed their password, you're going to want to store that password in Class Link. To do this, click on the student's icon on the top right hand corner and click on the words My Profile. Click on Sign In Options and then the word Update. Type in the student password twice and press Submit. Now when the student clicks on Office 365, it will automatically log them in. As a recap, if you are having difficulty with ClassLink, there are a few troubleshooting tips. Clear your cache, install the ClassLink extension, save your password in ClassLink, and last, restart your computer.